Congress party members under the leadership of Sachin Singh Verma, who is the former MP and present AICC secretary, met the Devas SP. There was a demand made for the revoking of National Security Act against Karni Sena member Umesh Kaur, who is also a Congress worker. Gaur is believed to have led a mob of Karni Sena goons and vandalized Dhaba. In order to come up with more alternatives to save the government, if the Madras High Court sets aside the disqualification of 18 rebel MLAs, the ruling AIA DMK offered to give the reins of the party to the Sasikala family. However, the condition is that they keep TT Vidyanakaran at bay. Superstar Kamal Hassan refuted charges that he is an anti-Hindu and said that he is nobody's enemy. In his regular column in a popular Tamil weekly news magazine, Ananda Vikatan, he further said that he views Islam and Christianity the same way. A BJP worker was murdered in Bengaluru. This comes just days before Prime Minister Narendra Modi's public rally in the city. Predictably, it has set up a political row between the BJP and the Congress. BJP termed the murder a continuation of the series of murders of Hindu activists. Protests by the North Indian students continue at the administrative block of CUSAT campus in Cochin over being served beef cutlets. The students have demanded that the principal should step down. Karnataka BJP is all set to organize a 24-hour cow protection yagna on February 2nd in Bengaluru. The event will be organized by the cow protection cell of the BJP and the main aim will be to create awareness among the people about cattle. BJP released a statement to the same effect. In yet another case of medical apathy in Bethul in MP, a newborn died after a pregnant woman was not given a stretcher and was forced to walk. The nursing assistant who came with her asked the hospital staff to provide her with a stretcher. But it all went in vain. The National Investigative Agency has arrested a youth, Mehfuz Alam, from Gopal Ganj district of Bihar, while the Kolkata STF arrested Jamaatul Mujahideen terrorists in Kolkata. This in connection with the bomb blasts that took place in Bodh Gaya. It has not been an easy journey for IPL's new buy, Manzoor Dar. The hardships that he had to undergo helped him to stay focused to fulfill his dream.